In this video, we will review how to add your attachment and calibrate that attachment for your SiteWorks machine guidance machine. Keep in mind, we'll have to have successfully connected to and set up a machine before continuing on with this process. So to initially add an attachment, we'll click Add New Attachment on the drop-down menu, and that should bring us to the next page, the Attachment Definition screen. On this screen, we'll enter in the attachment name along with just two measurements for the attachment. The first measurement, pivot point to attachment cutting edge, is measured straight down from the pivot point to the tip of the attachment. Make sure that you measure as parallel to the center line of the linkage as possible for the best results and most accuracy. The second measurement, attachment cutting edge, is simply the width of our attachment cutting edge. Once you're happy with your measurement, Go ahead and click Save, and this will bring us back to the Machine Guidance Settings page, where we'll click Attachment Calibration to continue on with the next step. To perform the attachment calibration, we'll use the IMU data from the receiver to align the stick until the pitch and roll values on the screen are within 0.1 degrees. This should result in the GNSS receiver being plumb with the pivot point at the bottom of our stick. Now that the receiver is plumb with the pivot point, you'll want to drop a plumb bob from the pivot point to the cutting tip to ensure the cutting tip is also in plumb with the rest of the system. Once the front linkage is plumb, click record and the attachment calibration angle will automatically populate. This angle will vary depending on the size and dimensions of the attachment. So it's important to note that we need to re-perform this calibration every time we change an attachment on our machine.